This is such an achievement. Not many people have dug into Caradon before. And um, I'm proud to say, myself and Jim, I'm a sterling effort. So that's the way back out. We're gonna come and document this. A bit better, get some proper torches. Proper torches, I mean, decent bits of kit, you know. So surprisingly, most of this timber is pretty good. I have to say that and I'll snap, a snap. <laughs> but it's mostly pretty good. There's a really good airflow through here. And um, oh, this is gorgeous, this is absolutely gorgeous. I'm literally in heaven. I've <laughs> creamed my pants so many times trying to get in here. Now it's back open. Guys, if you could please respect coming in here. Don't bring novices. This is a dangerous, dangerous mine. It really is. So, um, just be aware. Whew. Why we wear helmets? Why we wear helmets? All right, it's gonna be deep. It's gonna be deep. Sorry, I'm not very good. Video in. So this was the original entrance here, and as you can see. Some clever buggers funnel through there. It's going to take a bit more digging to get a proper access and get some fat knackers through here, but we're in. So I'm... I've got to take my helmet off to go up here. Oh, that's so exciting! That's amazing! Amazing! So, uh... that's the size of my hat, and we're going to crawl up back. Right, let's take that. Not gonna need that today. Hello mate! Oh I thought that was your light there. It's not, it's my work light isn't it? Jesus. Yeah we're gonna have to widen this out but it won't take long mate. Let's just literally pull it back through and pull it, pull it back through. Got it. What? Oh. Yeah, first squeeze, which isn't actually much of a squeeze to be fair. Yeah. Um, I didn't even get to the blue wall. 